There's lots of benefits to the apprenticeship program in terms of work-life balance. Being in that hospital environment for a prolonged period as opposed to just placements and then having to go back and forward from learning and clinical placement will be very beneficial to anybody learning on the apprenticeship programme. I've done a lot of research into the outcomes for ODPs and employability at the end. As my local university, this was a great choice for me to choose ODP to study. The apprenticeship offers um, an alternative to an undergraduate programme in terms of accessibility. We've been delivering a hybrid programme for some time on the undergraduate and on the apprenticeship we're going to be completely online. We're able to deliver and support students wherever they are in the country. The apprentices will already have been working in the theatre environment. We'll already see that they can handle the day-to-day, -day, the challenges and that they work together well with the team that they could potentially end up joining. So I think the, the apprenticeship really does offer that whole career progression. We want to be able to offer an opportunity for people to further their careers. We're going from band two as a support worker all the way up to band seven and eight as a theatre manager. So this ODP apprenticeship is a great source for people from different backgrounds and different situations. The apprenticeship allows them to be employed, paid, and able to study and get a qualification. So I think that being able to earn whilst you're learning will enable students to put all of their energy into learning their specific role, which will make them better practitioners in the future. The UEA would be a really good partner for any employer looking to have a, a operating department practice apprenticeships. We have a very close relationship with the University of East Anglia. We have noticed that by having apprentices, that we will be able to train students that will eventually work within the trust. And we are able as well to hire or get ODPs uh, within the communities. We have meetings every fortnight where we keep in contact with our practice partners and we can share potential learning as a group so that we grow as a specialty between both the hospitals and the university. Having that support as well from the university and from clinical educators has been really valuable. So you have two really good core elements during study. So you have the relationship with, say, the James Paget University Hospital and the education department, the management here, alongside who have a good relationship with the apprenticeship course at the UEA. So they will then get responses from us and that, uh, that will help build that community. And then at the end of each year, we will have a residential and that residential was a chance for all the students to come together. We will do some clinical skills simulation. We will have some assessments that are built into that process at the end of the year. We have clinical educators, we have uh, numerous mentors, supervisors, assessors, and the managers of theatres are really very helpful with regards to apprentices in theatres. If you go down the apprenticeship route, that allows the employer to capitalise on the potential of any member of staff, take them through that middle gap where, where they would go off and do their professional training, and then keep them back in the organisation so that they can carry on and go through to, to higher levels. We have an 100% employment record on the ODP course because we are a very in-demand specialty. We are actually in need of individuals, not just young, young and old, who are willing to come and help us. Uh, we are so short on the floor. We'll give you the best possible learning that is available from us that we can give you. The NHS want to nurture someone and create the best healthcare professional out there, and they'll be nurturing you from day one in the trust you are working in as an apprentice. Obviously the university has been great, it's been really supportive and I would encourage anybody that's thinking about having a career in operating department practice to apply to the apprenticeship programme at UEA.